find sin 840. To find this, we should follow this method C. Here we have 840. Now you should check. 840 lies between which two multiples of 180? What I mean is 840 lies between 720 and 900. This is 180 into 4 and this is 180 into 5. Between these two numbers 840 lies. Next. Now 840 is close to which number? This is close to 900. So 840 now should be written as 900 minus 60. So this will become sin in place of this, we should write this 900 minus 60. This is your step 1. Next, sign. In place of 900, now we should write 5 into 180 minus 60. Next. Here we have 180, so sign is not going to change, it will remain sign. And inside we get this angle 60. Now the question is, will we get here plus or minus? To answer that, we should look at the number before 180, that is 5. And 5 is odd, and all the odd multiples of 180. They lie in either in the second or in the third quadrant. So now to select the quadrant, we should look at this symbol. Here we have negative. That means angle lies in the second quadrant. And in the second quadrant, sign is positive. So we should put plus. So plus sine 60 is root 3 by 2. This is our answer.